This section of the Start Making Biodiesel DVD shows you how to make the second solution by mixing alcohol and vegetable oil. Okay. All right. Um, so what's our next step? Our next step is to mix the alcohol and the vegetable oil together to make the second solution. Okay. Let's do it. We mix 10 milliliters of isopropyl alcohol or rubbing alcohol with and we mix that with one milliliter of vegetable oil. Okay, so this is any type of rubbing alcohol. It doesn't yeah. matter. It should be at least 70% of 70% of alcohol by volume. Okay. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> okay, so we have the alcohol. Now what? Now we need one milliliter of vegetable oil. Okay. I'm using this pipette here to, to determine the amount of liquid. Okay, so this vegetable is kind of dark. But now, when I go to the store and I go to buy vegetable oil, it's never this dark. So is this used or is this brand new? or? This is definitely used vegetable oil. This is the recommended vegetable oil you, you want to use because it's, it's either very cheap or free from any local restaurant who's willing to give you their waste vegetable oil. So it's not recommended for you to buy fresh vegetable oil. It's better to use that oil than whenever it's done, make it out of biodiesel. Okay, so what if I don't have any used oil and I have some old oil that was just left in my house from whenever I bought it? <laughs> Is that cool? Can I, can I use that? Yeah, you can use fresh sources too. If, if you decide you're not going to use the oil anymore, then yeah, you, there won't be no problem using, making biodiesel out of it since you're not going to use it for a food source. Okay, cool. So how much of this again are we putting into the alcohol? We're putting one milliliter of vegetable oil. Okay. And also, what is this contraption you have in your hand? <laughs> what is the name of this white thing here? This right here is a laboratory pipette. It, could, it can measure very small amounts of liquid, which is very good for accurate amount, for accurately determining the uh, the amount of sodium hydroxide that is needed. So where would I be able to find one of those? You, you could buy one of these at in any uh, chemistry store or, or online at, at the chemistry website. And these are the most expensive type of me measuring small liquids. But you can also buy a cheaper version, which is a disposable pipette. And these cost very cheap. You could buy a 100 pack for less than 20 bucks. And once we mix the once you have the, the, the two liquids, the alcohol and the oil together, you mix it to make sure the oil dissolves in the alcohol. For more information, check out our website at www.startmakingbiodiesel.com.